Good morning, everyone. It's EU Patch Day. As you can tell by everybody at the vault, it's time for another Sleepy Vault opening. It's currently 9.17 in the morning, and I have a splitting headache. <laughs> the joys. I also have a nice mouse effect now. Woo. Win. Take the L. Uh, same as last time, guys. Let's go over our vault and see what happens. So today's vault on the Warlock is a pretty small vault. I've kind of been neglecting my Warlock. Uh, we are Destruction. Uh, Spect, and let's see what we have. So two rings, both of hero level, none of which are an upgrade. So we are on our Warlock. It's going to be a bit of a pushover. And we're going to take the Coins of Merit with our 19 keystone. Throne of the Tides. Don't we love Throne of the Tides? Now on to a new character in our roster. It's our Windwalker Monk. I've been uh, toying around with this class for about a week and a half now. Done a couple of mythics on it. It's been really fun. Also, with the new patch, our Covenant abilities have now changed. I think this is really pretty. I like it. So I'm looking forward to seeing a few of them and how they look now. But uh, anyhow, we are Windwalker spec for our monk. We didn't do that many keys on it, <clears throat> so I don't expect a big vault. Yeah, just one, and it's going to be tier piece, which is a straight upgrade. No need to worry about that with Keystone 5. And uh, I did notice when I logged in, uh, that we had a um, we had a new talent to choose from because whatever was here is now gone. So now we have Dance of the Wind. I don't think anyone's going to be picking this in Mythic unless you are uh, tanking, I assume. But yeah, keep an eye on your uh, talents, guys. They might have reset. Moving right along. We now have our warrior, our arms warrior. We did try a little bit of a stint and a fury in a, uh, in a key, and it didn't go well. It didn't go well at all. But we're still pretty low gear. This is 442. Uh, we are arms spec for gear, and we only have one item, which is boots. Straight upgrade anyway, so we're going to take it. We've kind of been a bit lax with keys. Uh, on our alts, which has been very sad. 15 tiles are easy to do. Now over to our Keystone Master Druid, which I've had a little recent stint in playing again. Uh, with now I was playing Balance. Currently at 465. I had my loot spec as Feral earlier to help some friends gear up. Uh, we did quite a few keys on this one last night and the night before, so have a full vault for this one and it's a choice between legs a back and a focus i'm going to be taking the focus because i am currently using a one-hander and offhand and this is going to be very helpful so no contest on that one this is kind of a character we're just throwing away in all honesty i don't foresee us playing this character that much unless we are helping friends out so yeah, and we have a 16 Ataldazar to do on it. Nice, nice, nice. And our final character that we've done Mythics on, <coughs> and the one we played the most this week, is our Survival Hunter, who has slowly became our new main at 474 item level and rocking in at 2590 at IO. Should be getting a huge vault for this one because we've also done Heroic uh, this week, which we'll be doing again. Let's see, what are we getting? I'm a little bit disappointed. <laughs> uh, I was really, really hoping for the Farak weapon, but it was too good to be true. Oh well. So, we have uh, some glove upgrades that we could take. We have the Augury, which is another trinket that we could use uh, for for AoE, we have oh, two sets of mythic hands, okay so one's actually tier set 
Uh, this one is Myth Set, so that's a huge upgrade. And uh, Mythic Legs, which is a boost from Normal. And the Porcelain Crab, which is terrible for us. So I'm going to be taking on this one. I know normally I would go for the Augury, but I will be taking the Legs because that is a huge 20 item levels up from the normal legs that we have. So I will be taking the legs, unless I do have legs here. They are hero. No, so I will be taking the legs. And we'll be getting a 21 out of it as well. <clears throat> and with that being said, let's look at our affixes for this week. We're currently dealing with Afflicted and Bolstering, so for DPS players like myself, this really is not going to be a problem. Uh, especially as a Hunter, I cannot do anything about Afflicted. And Bolstering... Bolstering is Bolstering. <laughs> you know, it's it's not as bad as last week. But uh, I think this week is going to be a bit of a challenge for some people. Uh, especially the ones that go Unga Bunga, un unlike dying instantly to bursting you're just going to die to a big mob hitting you i just picture the uh, bears on dark heart thicket are going to get huge and destroy things but uh other news guys so it is patch day there has been some rework so as you can so monk got a change to the talents as we've seen there's no re there's nothing in the <clears throat> there's nothing in the lines for survival there was some there was two pvp changes which were kind of silly uh, in all honesty and i guess big news for me is that i have now joined a mythic progression guild and i will be doing my trial today you can catch that tonight on stream and i will see you guys later on there'll be no music for this one just i uh i think i'm maybe too quiet for the music so thank you guys for watching and i will see you all tonight goodbye <laughs>